welcome to a basic tutorial on how to create Excel graphs. We will begin by creating a simple line graph over the number of times a student talks out during class. Next, select your data, go to the Insert tab, and see All Charts. Once there, go to the All Charts tab, go to Line Graph, and then select your graph. Now we must create the horizontal and vertical axis titles. Double click your graph and go to Add Chart Element. Once added, type in the titles. Now successfully created a basic line graph. However, with many things in behavior analysis, you are often comparing baseline data with intervention changes. In your x-axis, type in intervention and leave the y-axis blank. Create a new phase change column and in that add the highest number that appears on your y-axis, which is 11 in this example. Select your new data table and insert a graph as shown before. You will see that there is a space between the baseline data and the intervention data where the intervention took place. To make this clear, go to the Add Chart element, go to Error Bars, and the More Error Bars option. Select Phase Change. Once your error bar is selected, go off to the right hand side of the screen and click on the graph icon. Select Minus and change the fixed value to the largest number in your Y axis, which again is 11. Now that your baseline data and intervention data are separated, you must add in the titles as shown before. Finally, you have the option to add or remove grid lines from your graph. APA format is without grid lines. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching.